Welcome to Eco Ask Why, a podcast that dives into industrial manufacturing topics and spotlights the heroes that keep America running. I'm your host, Chris Granger, and on this podcast, we do not cover the latest features and benefits on products that come to market. Instead, we focus on advice and insight from the top minds of industry because people and ideas will be how America remains number one in manufacturing in the world. So welcome to Eco Ask Why. For this initial episode, I want to take a few minutes to talk about the purpose, about why we're doing this. What is it all about? I'd like to also take a, just a minute or two to introduce myself, Chris Granger, as your, as your host as we go through these podcasts. So I've had an opportunity at ECO as a, to be a co-op student when I was in college at Old Dominion, straight from there, working full-time. And at a distributor, I've had a chance to, to do multiple different roles, from working into the warehouse, to the counter, to, to sales, to most recently, I was uh, the motor repair division. I oversaw that. And the role that I'm currently in is engineering and services manager for the Carolinas. So I've had a great opportunity to, to learn a, a bunch of different things and, and experience industry from four states, being involved with a lot of different plants, uh, good exposure to, to, to what's happening in industry, what's going on, things that are changing, uh, things that our heroes are facing. And let me just be clear about one thing when I'm talking about our heroes. I'll talk about our purpose here for a second. We want to build a better tomorrow. And our heroes, they're the people that build things and keep them running. Now, I know that sounds very simple, but that's true. That rings true. We serve manufacturing plants, machine builders, construction teams. that are out there making our community strong today and better tomorrow. So if all of this rings true, we're going to focus on learning more about why our heroes exist, what challenges they're facing in the future. And what are some of the goals they're trying to accomplish? Everyone has goals. Everyone has things that they're chasing. So we want to understand what they are because you may have similar goals in your career path. And we're going to keep asking why. And we're going to keep centered on the purpose. I also want to tell you what this is not. This is not going to be a commercial about features and benefits of products. We're not going to do that. We want to keep this higher level. We're not going to bash competitors. We're not going to, because Eco represents one brand, we're not going to talk about the other. No, it's going to be none of that. We're going to be centered around two things, people and ideas. People and ideas over products. That will be what we stick to, period. So talking about purpose, I have an interesting story that I would like to share with you. It ties back to the motor service days, but trying to understand purpose and what I was trying to, to get my team to understand their greater purpose in industry. Because you have to imagine if you're working in a motor service or a motor repair shop, you only see what's in front of you. Think about the manufacturer out there who only sees the, the part of the, the plant that they're in or the part of the production line that they're in. They may not see the final product. So they might not actually be able to understand their impact. And this, so this happens in the shop. Motor comes in, it goes out. It comes in and it goes out. But they may not, they never really truly get to see the impact that it has. So we took, we, we, we shut the shop down for a day and we took the group out to a manufacturing plant and they were given a tour. And on this tour, they were able to see where the equipment that they worked on was actually tied into the process where it was making product. The maintenance manager at the plant was able to talk to them as well about the impact of their quality and, and, and the equipment that they put in. So it got the guys a chance to see to a very real level what they do, why it's important, and how is it having an impact on the world. And that was one plant. So as we huddled up at the end, we, we sat outside, and we we're talking amongst ourselves, like, guys, we serve hundreds of plants. And imagine all the tentacles that, that are tied to the different products that these manufacturers make. You're not just working on motors. You're impacting the world. 
you know, that in itself created so much more purpose with that team. Uh, the attitude changed in the shops. People could really, they got behind that. They could see that. They felt they had more fulfillment about what they did. There was more joy uh, just in that day itself, just being able to see there was some pride out there. Hey, I worked on this. I fixed this, and this is impacting it here. And that's what we want to bring with this podcast is those types of stories, those types of experiences that if you're in a manufacturing plant, you're not just looking at section A, A of the plant. You're looking at the bigger picture. You understand your, your tie to it. We all make an impact. Everyone does. No matter what, if you're an uh, E&I technician, you're in purchasing, you're in maintenance, you're, you're in operations or, or management, you all make an impact. What we have to work on together is finding purpose. And if we understand why, we're going to all have a greater sense of joy. Again, you matter. What you do matters. And if you understand that why, it will set you apart. There are a couple qualities that I'm really searching for in these podcasts that I hope to bring out and I hope that everyone will find value in. They're kindness, empathy, and compassion. You know, if, if we can center on that, and, and really, truly understand what others are up against, what they're trying to accomplish, I think that's going to bring us so much value. We're going to learn together, and we're going to enjoy just time learning about industry. So we're always looking for topics. We're always looking for ideas and guests. What do you want to hear? You may be listening to this running on a treadmill. You may be listening to it driving in a car. Or you could be working on a piece of equipment in a plant. On or in the break room with your buddies. And we hope that if you're in those environments and you're in an industrial manufacturing plant, that you're getting value from this. So please comment. Please send us direct feedback. Please reach out to us. If you want to be a guest, we'd love to have you. Because you, if you're listening to this, you are our heroes. And that's who we want to talk to. So again, my name is Chris Granger. I look forward to bringing you these episodes. And I hope you have a blessed day. Thank you for listening to Eco Ask Why. This show is supported ad-free by Electrical Equipment Company. Eco is redefining the expectations of an electrical distributor by placing people and ideas before products. Please subscribe and share with your colleagues and friends. Also, leave comments, feedback, and any new topics that you would like to hear. To learn more or to share your insights, visit EcoSY.com. That's E-E-C-O-A-S-K-S-W-H-Y.com.